Hello and welcome to a beautiful wasteland. This is a mod overhaul of Fallout 3. We've started the playthrough. This is episode 2. Uh, the backstory for this character using the alternate start mod is that we were declared a traitor by the Enclave. And we're on the run trying to survive on our own in the wasteland. Uh, we started with some pretty basic gear, but we started all the way up in the northwest corner of the map where the Enclave facility is. And we're trying to make our way down towards Megaton. We've been following the Potomac here. Last episode, we made it to this five axles rest stop, which is sort of a raider hideout. And we took out the locals and we basically spent the night rested up and we're getting ready to head out again into the wasteland. It's a beautiful morning here by the looks of it. The sun's just coming up. Uh, behind us, I can see that we do have some super mutants that are hanging out kind of just north of the rest stop here. Uh, we're not going to want to get into it with them because we're just so low level at this point that there's really no chance. So we're going to have to basically keep a low profile and get on the move. On the way into the rest stop here, I did notice a uh, Red Rocket gas station just up the hill. So we're going to go over and take a look at that, maybe do a little looting before we join our path sort of to the southeast again. So without further ado, guys, let's hit the road. gas station's just over the hill there. So I'm going to creep up and take a look. These signs are great. Look at this. So I'm going to creep a fair bit as we go, just because there are so many really hostile and high level enemies in this general part of the map that we don't want to encounter them and get surprised. We want to make sure we have the option to get away. Okay, here's the gas station here. Nice, rock breakers last gas. we got 40 experience for showing up. Always a good thing. Okay, I see a scorpion up on the hill there, a rad scorpion. See what we can loot from here. Nothing in the trash. Okay, we've got a uh, dead wastelander here. Bottle caps. A rat away. Take the potato crisps because we're still going to need food. Nuka Cola. Uh, see, there's a Nuka Cola Quantum on top of the uh, Nuka Cola machine here. Nuka Cola inside. That's a great looking machine. Look at that. It's a retexture. All right, guys. Um, it looks like there's a pathway here just up into the woods. Uh, and let's just take a quick look back here and see what's over down this way. Oh dear, what's that? Wastelanders. Ah, and they're friendly. It looks like they just shot something too. Let's go over and see if we can do business with them. What did they kill? Raiders? Nice. Look at that. That's awesome, guys. Good, good job. Uh, bo bottle cap, Molotov cocktail, and axe. Wow, the axe is pretty good damage too. I'm gonna take it for some reason. Uh, bottle cap, mole rat jerky is always good. The Badlands armor, we're trying to unload all that armor if we can. Help. Cattle prod, not very valuable. And the Badlands armor is garbage. I don't suppose. I don't know you, you I don't, don't know, know me, me, you don't know me. Let's keep it that way. Let's keep it that way. I just How wonder about if I can... you just mind your own business, okay? Let can me I do be blunt. do business with these? I'm not no. looking Go for away. trouble or conversation either. This guy's looking pretty rough. Whoa. Yeah, it's been a hard wasteland for him. My gosh. Okay, let's drop some of this stuff because we're a little overweight right now. Uh, we've got... Now we're wearing the leather armor we started with. It's the best damage resistance. Uh, we did find this Sharp Dressed Raiders armor, which is really cool. But it's only a 16 DR, so we'll, we'll hold on to it. But it has the speech bonus, which is a big deal. Um, this stuff's pretty junky. Let's drop the, the Badlands armor. Okay, that put us under. Let's go. Well, maybe I wasn't overweight, actually. I was just walking. Whoops. <laughs> So let's go back the way we came. And uh, I don't know if there's anything down here, is there? That's gonna be heavily radiated. 
cool. I mean, I don't want to go diving in that just yet. Maybe there's something down there, but I want to go in with uh, a rad suit or something. Biohazard suit. All right, so um, I think I'm going to get back to the river. So this is an Enclave iBot. I'm noticing that the iBots are not hostile, even though the Enclave is supposedly hostile. These things aren't. Cool. Okay, below fly over there. Yeah, I got to get the small arm scale up a bit. We've got really, really jerky um, hold on that weapon. Okay, so river's down here, but looks like we've got a settlement here. This looks like raiders. Let's take a peek. Uh-oh. That's going to be the blowflies. I hate blowflies because you almost can't take... You can't get them clean. You can't kill them clean, and they... Uh, they're not worth really any experience. This one's chasing me, though. Okay, see, there's a boar down there. I'm going to leave that thing, I think. So I don't know what this place is. Blowfly's still on my case. Okay, I see some movement there. Okay, so we've got a ghoul that's called as a wastelander, but he's hostile. He's red. Blowfly's red. Wastelander's red. Interesting. Unfriendly, uh... Wastelanders. We just ran into some friendly ones. But iguana on a stick, I'll take that. But I suppose in the apocalypse it's okay to be um, unfriendly. It's sort of to be expected. Maybe we'll let them be. They're just wastelanders. I'm going to get rid of this thing. It's pesky. Low fly here. It's a red one. Yeah, so you get the one experience. I guess you get the meat. That's the main bonus. Let's go back down to the river. I think it's kind of the right, uh, the right way to get get through all this. And yeah, you know what? Let's kill some mole rats and boars. It is sort of free experience. Oh gosh! What's this? Dead dog? Take the dog fur. Okay, so yeah, I want to get back down to the river. Low fly. This one doesn't see me yet. Oh, it's running. Better idea. Oh, it's back. No meat on that. All right, here we go. Back to the river. Okay, we, it looks like we've got... I want to say this is going to be raiders. Pretty quiet so far. Okay, no. Somebody's there. Yep. Raider with a submachine gun. Um, yeah, if I had better sniping, I'd try to take him out. We gotta level the small arm scale. It's really important. Let's give him the slip. They've got a base there. Something to take out at a later date when we're higher level. Is this the river? Yeah, okay, Lorks over there. We're not going to mess with them. They're too high level for us. I don't know if this is the river. This might be just a pond. Hold on a sec. Oh, yeah. There, who's that? Slaver. Okay. She's not uh, hostile. So that's a good thing. I wonder if I can sell something to her. I wonder if I get her to engage the Lork over there. A dog. 
do you think you're doing? She won't sell anything to me. I don't know you. You don't know me. We Let's actually look going. very similar. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see what we got here. Okay, we've got a Mr. Gutsy there. Do not want to mess with that thing. Wait a sec. There are looks over there. Okay, check it out. So we've got uh, a settlement over there, a city, at least a town. Let's go take a look at that. Old boat here. Pretty cool. Yeah, there were some Mirelurks on the other side of this hill. I don't want to aggro them. I can help it. Let's go sneak. We'll creep up this hill here. Nice and quiet. Okay, so what's this going to be over here? Settlement, maybe. Alright, so we've got a couple of buildings here. Tires freak me out for a sec. There's a door over there. Um, let's take a look here first. Okay, what do we got? The Doghouse Hotel. Um, let's go in and take a look. Okay, we got mole rats. Ran. Okay. Water's still running, guys. Big one. Got me. Oh. Sorry, more rats. It's got to be this way. So what's all in here? This is sort of hard to tell, but there's a lot of messy stuff in here. A lot of people died in here. What do we got? Nuka-Cola lamp. That's pretty cool. Whiskey. I guess I'll take the whiskey. Cash register's empty. Scotch I'll take. Scotch. What's this? A Vault Boy toy. It looks like a bobblehead, but it's just a toy. It's not worth anything. Collectible, I guess. More Scotch. I yeah, hear some more mole rat action in here. Didn't seem fair. Room key. Oh, interesting. wonder what that's good for. Okay, shotgun shell. Oh, there's lots of room keys. Okay. Uh, I suspect they're not to be used for anything. Ashtray. Oh, we got a sawed-off shotgun. Nice. That's big. There's a lot of room keys. Hotel master key. I'll take that. Okay. So if we have the master key, we don't need the room key. I guess the key... Oh, we have it on our key ring. Let's take a look. Do these weigh anything? No. Okay, cool. So we can just take them all, I guess. Here we go. Okay, cabinets are empty. Braxo cleaner. Ah, it's only worth five. I'm not going to take it. Dead weight. Okay, let's see if we can go upstairs and open some of these rooms up. Second floor. Uh oh. It's not good. 
the Mr. Gutsy in here. Flamethrower Mr. Gutsy. I if I can deactivate it somehow. It's an evil Mr. Handy. Nice. Took it down. Okay, that's done. Nuka-Cola, carton of cigarettes, nice. And turpentine, I'll take that. Okay, so that's that. A couple more mole rats by the sound of it. One's running, he knows better. Oh. So the room keys, in the end, didn't seem that necessary. Maybe there's one that's locked, though. We'll find out with the master key. So. These suitcases are great, though. Cartons of cigarettes. That's one of the most valuable things you can find. Individual packs of cigarettes, not so much, but the cartons are excellent. Here we go. Be nice to shut off that alarm. We got money. Carton of cigarettes, nice. Money, I'll take it. Bunch of filing cabinets. Ooh, 556 five, and bottle caps, good. Okay. Oh, we got a workbench, cool. Another one just run off? There it goes. It's the mole rat mambo here. Chasing mole rats, guys. It's a thing. Okay, Brahmin milk is so good because it's rad reduction. I'm going to take most of this. Um, we don't need all that food, but you never know. We'll throw some of it out eventually. So I really wish I could turn off that alarm. Super annoying. Mac and cheese, I'll take the cigarettes. You know you can't turn off the Jenny. So, oh cool, statue. So while we're here, I wonder, is it possible to make the dark gun? Oh. No, it's broken. It's all broken, wrecked. Let's see what we can do here. So we've got scrap metal, I'll take that. We've got conductors worth a fair bit. Sensor modules worth a fair bit. Over a cumber. Let's drop um, gain spike armor times two. Let's take a look at this. So can we make our dark gun? We need a toy car, we need surgical tubing. Okay, can we make a toolkit? Hammer, wrench, scissors, combat knife, and lunchbox. It's going to consume my combat knife. Uh, sensor module. There's the hammer. Okay, that's good. Wrench. Run away there. Oh, we do need to find another combat knife. That's good to know. Leaf blower. Remote control. I wonder what that's for. Uh, wood chipper. Weight 65. All pretty junky, guys. Um... Let's head out of here, but we know there's a, a workbench here. If we can stand the noise, we can come back. Let's go back down. All right. So it was a productive little stop, actually. That was cool. Uh, Northwest Seneca Station. Okay, grocery store. We've got the pawn and gun. Okay, let's check this out. Sounds good. Oh, it's still going on here. The uh, the alarm, it's in both buildings. Interesting. So a pawn shop, yes. Can't seem to get at this. Can we break it? 
No. Money? It's good. I'd like to get the gun, but it's not a great gun. Huh. We're locked? What's this? Interesting. There's still an active security camera. Okay, we got a dead wastelander with a knife. So, that's not a combat knife, though. What do we got here? Yeah, broken. Trashed. Okay, uh, scrap metal's good. Nuka Cola. A mammoth toy. Conductor is worth 30, I guess I'll take it. Brewer money, nice. Wow, guys, lots of stuff to loot here. Conductor, paint gun we have. Okay, cigarettes. Okay, 32 caliber rounds are always good. A little bit of pre-war money is good too. All right, so what's this? Okay, upstairs is collapsed. Uh, yeah, so this was interesting. Not a bad little uh, loot up. Ah, it's so loud though, good to get out of there. What about this? We've got the, uh, the cup of joe. Let's check a look. Okay, luckily the uh, alarm didn't extend to this part so far. Nice and quiet in here. Nasty though. Uh, toy. Okay, roller roller skate. We're looking for a toy car, right? Yeah. Pack of cigarettes. We're gonna have a lot of cigarettes to sell. That's for sure. Okay, junk, oh, a lot of junk. Uh, Cup of Joe House blend coffee, I'll take it. For the novelty of it. It's back here. Not much, just junk, guys. Filing cabinet, a dart, I'll take it. All right, let's go. Not, not exactly a great loot, but it is a wreck, this place, so. Perhaps to be expected, it's a coffee shop. Okay, what's here? I saw a door around this corner, let's just see. So we finish this building off. Ah, it's not open? Okay. Not accessible. So there's a subway tunnel here, by the looks of it. Subway station. Northwest Seneca, okay. Let's see, let's do the grocery store. It's nice. Hear something? Bottle caps, couple here. Oh, mentats. Oh, cockroach. Rad roach, that is. With some meat on it. Cram, I think we have enough food. We're gonna just not take any more food. Okay, nuka coolers are always good. It's hydration, but it's also a bottle cap, so it's double good. Turpentine, we're gonna leave. Okay, let's take a look over here. Beers. I think I'll leave them. Uh, sugar bombs we'll take. So I know at some point we get to sell those. Floor safe. Oh, it's locked easy. Let's see if we can do this. Nice. Ooh, 10 millimeter pistol. Bottle caps. Stealth boy. Some pre war money. Not the radio. Carton of cigarettes is good. Dancing uh, ro roach leg there, nice. First aid box. Diazepam gives you sedation and some damage resistance, but losing action points. I think I'll just leave it. Like I don't. That's not worth it. Multivitamin is some health. 
So that's good. Let's just take them right now. Otherwise, I'll carry them around forever. Multivitamin pills. Yeah, let's do it. Back our cigarettes. We did the floor safe. Oh, the terminal's locked. Let's activate it. So the hacking game, right? Hacking mini game. Okay, so how does this work? Consist, so two of seven correct. So the one thing I learned um, that I didn't know before was uh, that there's some special characters like this is a special character. I think it gives you more attempts basically. Um, yeah, I learned that recently actually. Okay, wanting five for seven, that's pretty close. So we have two attempts left. Uh, let's try waiting. Waiting will probably be it, but let's try the special character. Dud removed. Okay, so that one takes out uh, a non-answer. Let's try this one. This is a special character here. Removes a dud as well. Um, let's see if there's any other special characters we can use. Here's one. Takes out a dud. That's good. Alright, so I'm going to try waiting. Four for seven. One attempt left. Okay, I pretty much think it has to be, it could, uh, has to be winning. Yeah, gosh, guys, stress me out for a sec there. This just unlocks the safe, though, but it was worth it for the experience. 15 experience for that. All right, so let's head out. We, uh, we'll leave the dancing cockroach here forever. Detergent, uh, I don't know if we need that for anything. Harmonica. Let's head out. Uh, we did the pawn gun. Okay, let's check this next one down the way here. It's what? Shepherd's Hand. Free clinic. Here we got more roaches. This thing looks dangerous. I'm not going to mess with that. Let's check the vending machine. Nuka Colas are always good. Boy, it's really tough to see anything useful in all this junk here. Cigarettes. Okay, I just took something that I don't want. Okay, I don't need three paint guns, I don't think. Uh, I don't need two wrenches. The steam gauge assembly, I think I'm going to dump because it's so heavy. we get another one. They're pretty common. Okay, ooh, Stimpak, Radex, yes. Empty syringes and exposed syringes here. What shall you do? Nothing. Fill it with venom or take it. Cool, I can fill it with my Rad Scorpion venom. Now, I don't really know how to use that, but... Okay, bone saw, I think we need that for a medical kit. A surgical tubing, we did need that as well. Tweezers we might need actually for the medical kit. Rad right away, nice. Cigarettes. Oh, cockroach. Gosh, we've got a lot of Nuka Colas. We're gonna have to burn through some of these first aid box. Diazepam, I think we said we weren't gonna take it because it's kind of dead weight. We're gonna be overloaded on meat soon. 10 millimeter rounds are good. Oh, what do we got here? Cigarettes. Bottle caps. Okay. Okay, sex and hygiene book, but it's just a, a gimmick. It's not an actual book. Cool. Onward, guys. It's out there. Just wood. Okay, second floor. Come on, boys. Press me. Uh oh. We got problems here. Uh, what do I have to fight with here? We've got a bunch of 10 millimeter pistols, axe. Combat knife is really good, but I think it's gonna come still down to the plasma rifle. Could try the 10 millimeter, 25 damage versus the plasma rifle, which is 91. It's just seriously destructive. This is a human by the sound of it though. Let's try the, wait, that was a damaged one. Oh, that's a good one. Cutter. 
Okay. Let's try something on him. Give him one of those. Nice. Sounds like that worked. Frag mines are the best. It's going to be worth it to take... Um, took them both. It's going to be worth it to take a few extra levels of explosives. Just because the frag mines are so good. Wastelander. A baseball bat. It's nah, not bad. Okay, surgical supplies. Medical brace. That's critical. Because that gives us the ability to fix um, broken leg... More empty syringes. I'm not sure really about those, but... Blood pack is hit points. Ibuprofen is free damage resistance. So I'll take that. Let's take the blood pack. Uh, and let's drop uh, some more Badlands armor. Because it's really no... In fact, let's just drop both of those. It's just not worth it. What do we got here? The Ripper. Weight 6, value 9. Let's take a look at the Ripper. It's not worth much. It's 54 damage, though. Um, actually, that would be a good replacement if we end up using the combat knife for our um, medical kit. So, yeah. Maybe I'll hold on to that and see if I can repair it. Surgical supplies. I'll take a couple more just because. I don't really know what they do, but I'll hold on to them. We got the stitch. Dead dog. Did I search this guy? Lab technician outfit. Science plus five. Nice. That's that's good. Special. Hold on to that. Crutch. I think we might need to carry one crutch. I don't know. If, like I think it has something to do with healing injuries. Okay. Morphine ignores crippled limbs. Damage resistance plus fifteen. That's excellent. Morphine's good. Probably severely addictive though. We've got more syringes. I guess I'll just take some. More crutches. I don't know how many crutches I want to walk with. I think medical brace is better, actually. Okay, we're going to be overweight again. We have just too much stuff. Let's see if I can drop the Badlands armor. It's garbage. Need to save some space. Oh, this body. Bottle caps. Hey, that was the grossest sound ever. Feral ghoul, bottle caps. Good thing. So this was like a involuntary organ donation facility here. Um, let's go. It was lucrative. All right, guys, the sun's high in the sky here. It's nine, almost 10 a.m. Uh, let's just take a quick peek down here. Super dark, guys. Okay. Dead body here. Bottle cap. It's a dead wastelander. I'm going to say there's probably raiders down here. Yeah, here a mole rat. See a mole rat. Level, guys. Whoa. 14 skill points. Okay, so let's look at the critical ones. We already have block pick at 22. I think we want to go to 25 so that we can pick. I don't know why. We, maybe we have a buff on that. I'm not sure why before. Maybe it was on drugs. I was able to pick that lock that was easy, I thought. I thought it needed uh, 25, but I may be wrong about that. Uh, science, we need to get to 50 to do the next science. One thing I do know is that when we get to Megaton, we're going to need a repair skill to uh, to fix the bomb. So that's something. We also need barter. We need everything. <laughs> Speech also, I would say, is potentially important. Um, let's see. I want a little bit more. So I want, you know, I want a bit of everything. Let's take the small guns up and let's put a few more into barter. Or maybe I should put it into repair, and we'll just deal with the barter the way it is. Let's do that. 
Um, our barter is not absolutely terrible. But, yeah, I think it's a tough one. Yeah, repair we do need to bu to buff up. So over the next couple levels. So let's let's do that. In terms of perks, so we've got the same ones as before. Now they've given us swift reflexes. This perk enhances your reflexes in bullet time mode. You can remain in bullet time twice as long, and your sense of time is slowed an additional fifty percent. So bullet time again to refresh in the Fallout Wanderers edition. There's an option that allows you to um, have bullet time dependent on jet. So you have to take jet to get bullet time, and I've activated that. So there's a huge cost to doing bullet time. Yeah, basically, there's the addiction factor. But this will at least make it more worth it because you get more bullet time uh, twice as long and it's time slower. I think I'm going to do it. We haven't even used it yet. I don't even think I have jet. Let's just see. Yeah, we have one jet, so we could do it. Um, anyway. Some Nuka-Cola. Oh, rads. Check this other bathroom. All right, meat. You kind of got to be careful about these bathrooms sometimes because they have mines sometimes in the uh oh gosh right away multi multivitamin take the medical braces and the blood pack let's just eat the multivitamin and the medical ah oh, sorry the blood pack we had two of those let's just get rid of them because they're dead weight convert them oh teddy bear nice in the toilet cistern excellent uh, let's use the other blood pack Got some radioactive goo dropping out of the pipe there. Nice. Okay, I think. Oh, I think I remember this. Let me buff my speech. I think this is a guy here that we want to try to convince of something. You're not. not here to try and steal my secrets, are you? Uh, no. What secrets? The secret of making Ultra Jet, obviously. Okay. Oh, damn it. Now the cat's out of the bag. Typical me. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ultrajet, is that some sort of super cam? I suppose you could say that. Ultrajet is almost double the potency of jet. Perfect for ghouls. Jet barely affects us, you see. Only trouble is, it's almost impossible to gather the ingredients together. Okay. Say, you might be able to help me with that. Uh... Nothing's free in this world, Murphy. Yeah, no kidding. I didn't think you were a freaking charity. It takes three things to make Ultra Jet. Two of the ingredients I got plenty of. The other one is a little harder to find. Sugar bombs. Okay, sugar bombs, yeah. For this every is the sugar box bomb of guy. sugar bombs you bring me, I'll pay you 15 caps. So, you in? Let's do 37% speech, make it 30 caps. Oh, oh 15, it's 15 caps. each. You want to do it or? Okay, I'm in. Good. So that's too bad. I, I wish I had gotten the double, but in the end, do you really want to be walking to this guy every time you want to drop off sugar bombs? Not really, but so what did I think you I have some. Here's sugar bombs. So he gave me 30 bucks. So he's got a buddy in here. Barrett. Looking for a problem. So I can't steal his stuff. Uh, what else? Okay, so there's a passageway down to the sewer. What's he got in his toolbox? You're watching me. Any kind of sensor module, not stuff I need. Don't even think of breaking into that. Got a bed I can't sleep in. Got a mine box. Or a frag mines, yes, please. Pack of cigarettes, I'll take. See, small scale thievery is, is just part of the Fallout world. It's not it's not really a bad thing. You got the stuff, I got the caps. A match made in heaven. Yep. That's a pretty good deal. Uh Okay. So I could go into the sewer. Um, which is something of a detour perhaps. On my route to uh Megaton. Let's just go see where we're at. Let's take a look at the landscape here. So we've got... Okay. The river's here. Alright. 
So yeah, the river goes that way. I think I'm basically going to do that. I think I'm going to cross over and make our way over to the other side and kind of head towards Megaton. We could also go on this side, though. The, the road goes along here. Um, maybe that's the hot ticket. But I think what we're going to do, guys, is we've been running for about uh, 40 minutes, which I think is a good place to stop. So what we'll do is we'll cut here and we'll pick it up next time, guys. Um, thanks so much for watching. If you like this series, don't forget to hit the like button and say hello in the comments. And I'll catch you next time.